Transvestites in Waukegan. What did I know then? 16 at my first job. But the whole store tensed when they came, revolving through the plate glass doors, limber, over six feet tall, and so reed thin. Out between straight rows of pink scaparelli pantyhose, I strode, sales girl ready to help them decide size, color, and sheerness, my part stretching the nylon mesh. My hands curved back, made a smooth expanse to demonstrate texture and the look on long legs. I was tall myself and accustomed to stares, slanted predictions. They were beautiful, like Watusi dancers filmed in loose grass skirts. Their dark, flat-tipped fingers flipped the cardboard packages, mimed a rapture, ravishing matter. Why their deep, soft lips or their husky voices never alarmed me, I can't say except that, hairless on their limbs and as late to bloom as I, they were sisters from a universe that my tough, divorced boss sketching out bare facts as she smoked and stockroom gossips never touched. Sirens, rock-bound Great Lake divas, I clothed you.